Hello everybody, how are y'all today? I'm good. Oh, hello to my new subscribers as well. Um, thanks for following me. If this is your first time seeing me, you know, go ahead and subscribe too so that thank you can go to y'all too. So today I'm gonna do a quick updo and it consists of my extension locks. The same ones that I had. I haven't threw, uh, threw the old hair in the trash and I'm not. If anything, I'll just get another bag to add to it. So that I can have like more than enough. Because right now I always have just enough hair. For any hairstyle that I do. Just enough hair. So as you can see it is time for me to put a color on my hair. My locks that I have are burgundy. This is what they look like out of the bag. And I just clipped them onto a brush. But this is what they look like out of the bag. This is the equivalency of one bag. And then this is another bag. So all together I just have two bags. And I need three bundles. So I can be secure in my styles you know but anyway so these are the locks that i'm going to use today as you can see the color is like way off but don't worry i got some for y'all i got some for y'all like for real y'all about to love this i know because i love it and when i went out everybody was like girl we love it i know okay Okay, so now I'm just going to take some good old H2O, nothing else combined with the water, just water, and spray it all over my head. I'm going to make sure it's not drenched, but make sure that it's wet, you know, when they're wet, your locks are, they have more mobility to them. I'm, um, after applying that, I'm going to take some moisturizer. This is the Tropical Roots Conditioner. They actually have like a lock line, but I'm just going to use the moisturizer for today. And not even a lot, just one pump and just distribute that as evenly as I can across all of my hair because I'm doing the updo so I don't need that much. It's not like I'm wearing it down or anything. Just want to massage it all throughout the scalp and get it all on those ends, especially if you have colored locks. Now I'm just going to take the top part of my hair and put it in a ponytail. I will put the whole thing in a ponytail, but my hair does not fit in a ponytail just by doing one like I have to do two ponytails in order to like get most of it in and even then all of my locks are not going to be in a ponytail and that's fine do not stress this hairstyle it's not that serious y'all just get that ponytail up there at the top part and then do the second ponytail in which I'm going to show you guys how I achieve that one next Now, once you have the back up, you just want to take some bobby pins if you still have some loose locks that won't fit into the ponytail, and you just bobby pin them up. It doesn't matter if they're showing or not because you're not going to be able to see the back of your hair anyways. So you just want to make sure that all the locks are secure, and you don't really have to even make sure that all of them are up because it's not going to matter, I promise. You just kind of want to get as much up as possible. Look, a mess. Okay, but still... <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and take one bundle and just tie it on the top of my head. Just like that. You don't have to double tie it or anything. Then take the next bundle and do the same thing. Like I said, you don't have to double tie it. You just tie it on one time because this is just like a quick hairstyle. You know what? It may, if you want to keep it up for a week or two, go ahead and tie it like two or three times. But I'm just doing it this one time. So I'm going to flip it over on top of my pon my ponytail at the top of my hair. And I'm just going to put some bobby pins just to secure it. Now I'm just going to reserve a piece from the back section. And then the rest I'm going to um, wrap into a bun and bun my hair up at the top. Now the piece I have at the back, I'm just going to pull to the front and that's going to be my bang piece. You just want to be patient with your hair and work with it. If you need to use 579,000 bobby pins, that's fine girl. Do you. Just get it up there. Okay, so now all of those imperfections 
go bye bye because I just said the scarf and I wrap my hair like such and also I'm just gonna put a cute little bow at the top when it comes to my scarf you could do a knot or you could just wrap it and tuck the rest of it behind the bun but I just like bows because you know I'm cute and little and it's like a little doll you know Aww. but yeah so that's basically the gist of it the bangs at the front I'm just gonna take and tuck them until they're short enough to where I'm happy with the length of them but you could also kind of take some bobby pins and pin the bang first and then do it like that. But like I said, I'm not going to have mine up long. So I just tuck it underneath the scarf with my finger. And give myself like some cute little Chinese bangs or some cute little side bangs. <laughs>